Can I help you? Escape, Squire? <laughs> no, thank you. Not today. Are you sure me and Jack here are breaking out of this gruesome place? No, no, it's fine. You go on without me. <laughs> Good luck! Oh! Can't a hun get some peace and quiet? Brought you your breakfast, Mr. Hun the Hun, sir. I wouldn't want our castle's favourite prisoner going without his breakfast. Oh, Jailer. It looks delicious, but be a good man and procure me some more caviar and a few quail eggs. Oh, and some of those poison berry preserves. Mwah! Oh, it would be my pleasure, sir. Oh, yes, sir. And I'll keep this warm for you. Uh, wouldn't want to serve you a cold breakfast now, would we? <laughs> then I'll be right back to fluff up your pillows for your mid-morning nap. Hey! <laughs> A little piece of quiet. Uh. <laughs> Papa! Priscilla! How that did that little go? <laughs> Table, pass the salt. Window, open. Message for you, sir. Oh, dear. It's from Hannah the Hun. Ooh, I'm afraid my hunnish is a bit rusty, but uh, it says, uh, I'm here for husband Hun the Hun and daughter Drusilla being held captive by you. Must, uh, something something at all costs. Cannot leave without, uh, something something them. Hannah the Hun has come to take away Drusilla and her dad. She's brought her whole army! Perhaps I should close now, sir. Yes, Window, I think that would be a splendid idea. What are you going to do, Father? Nothing can withstand an attack from Hannah the Hun. I'll have to hand over Drusilla and her father at once. Finish your breakfast first. Remember, dear, we're gentry. <laughs> Hannah the Hun's laying siege to the castle. She's come to take you and your dad away. Mama. She's come to take us away? Away from all this? Meals served on silver platters. My luxury shack pile carpet. My glorious laser hun recliner. No, no, it's too horrible. <sighs> Don't cry, Drusilla. We'll think of something. Come on. So you see, we've got to figure out a way to keep Drusilla and her dad here. It's us versus a horde of Huns. Hmm. Tricky. I will single-handedly challenge 400 of Hannah the Hun's finest warriors to a joust. And behold, Drusilla and her father will be safe. Any useful suggestions? I've got it! I command the winds to scatter her troops, and the day will be ours! Oh, I've got it. I'll go home and go back to bed. Bob, how will that help? Oh, was I supposed to be helping? To beat a hun, you have to think like a hun. So what's your plan? I'm going to teach these barbarians how to fight like a girl. <laughs> Drusilla, you stay here and keep out of sight. We'll be right back after this is all settled. I challenge you to a contest of skill, endurance, and cunning. The Hun way. A Hun match. Yes, well, I don't quite understand. I mean, didn't you get my note? We got it, sister. And we didn't like it. Really? I thought it seemed very fair. And all I wanted to do was... So, it's a Hun match. You and me in a test of raw courage. You lose the Hun match, 
Drusilla and her dad get to stay here with us. Hooray! You win, you get them both back. Plus, you get your very own jester. My very own jester. That would be quite a comfort after a hard day ransacking and pillaging. Yeah, the jester comes in really handy. Hey, I accept. Let the Hun match begin! The first round in today's events, folks, is the feasting contest. <laughs> the feasting will be followed by the brutal and barbaric Hun assault and obstacle course, so severe that King Rockbolt of the Baltic described it as... Uh, really awful. <laughs> Why Liddy can win this? I'm not meant for a hun's life. I'm barely meant for my own life. Lucky for you, I have a plan. You, you do? do? Wait a second. Is this like the plan you had to stuff me with apricots to see if I'd turn into a fruit salad? Better than that. We shall drop a house upon Hannah the Hun's honey's head. I will raise a house with my magic and bring it down upon her like, like... A ton of bricks? No, more like a ton of bricks. Couldn't you think of something more practical that doesn't involve magic? A little more of a sure thing? Trust me, Bob. Have I ever let you down before? Don't answer that. Come on, we've got work to do. That's right, Hunt Match fans. It looks like the brutal and barbaric Hunt Assault and Obstacle Course is well on the way. Hannah the Hunt has a substantial lead. Will Lady Liddy be able to pick up the slack? Let's see. Come on, Lady Liddy. You can do it. Up and over. <laughs> I bet that hurt. Still, it's nice to have a bit of a lie down for a change. On you, but that's not why I'm crying. In fact, I really like the whole house from above technique and could have really used it last year when I was crushing the cities of Magdalisha. No, what's really upsetting me is that I won't see my Han and Drusilla. What? I was just passing by the area and I thought I would stop in and say hello. What? Why didn't you just say so in the first place? I did. My note clearly stated that I would be popping in to say a quick hi to my hubby Handahan and my dearest daughter Drusilla, who are being held captive, in a very friendly way, by you. Oh, is that 
what it said. Well, come on in. Stay as long as you want. My darling, let me show you around. Look, this is what I call my lazy hand recliner. <laughs> I perfected it myself. Great to see you. I can't stay late for an appointment. You see, I have been meaning to pillage the town of Pilantia for some time now. And what with the new house dropping technique, I should be hitting the campaign trail. Mama. Bye bye. Bye bye, Mama. It's where she belongs. Out there. Forever free, pillaging, destroying, obliterating. Oh, it's better this way. Mm -hmm. 